Hello guys, Ronnie here and welcome to a 23rd jQuery video tutorial. Now in this tutorial we are going to look at the jQuery, uh, the prevent default event in jQuery. What I'm going to talking about is uh, when for example you have a link and when the link is create, cl clicked, nothing happens, like it doesn't go, like it's, it's, it's just prevented from, uh, you know, maybe accessing the page or stuff like that. So let me just go ahead and create something here, and uh, let's uh, create uh, uh, href equals to uh, http review.com. Everybody uses Google nowadays, and I say uh, Google. And uh, and um, now I'll just leave it at that, and I'll save that. And I'll say I'll come here and just get rid of this code. So we'll see when the document is ready. We want to prevent the default. So actually, let me just refresh the page so we can see what we have here. Yes, help Google. When I click it, it just takes me to Google, right? So. Uh, let's prevent the default from happening from doing that. So we just say that, uh, and we just uh, you know select it, and we say um, click, and we say uh, function, and inside the function we say event. Nah, right here. Event, and we come here. And we say, we just create a space there. And we say event that prevent default. And we want to alert the user. And say cannot access stuff like that. And let's see what we have. So F5, and I click it. So this power cannot access. Cannot access. So you cannot visit it. Though it's a link, you can't visit it. Uh, you can get rid of the alert. Doesn't visit, doesn't work. So that's the um, prevent default uh, function in jQuery. Um, subscribe, uh, rate this video. I'll see you in my next video.